everyone this is bro welcome to my video uh today i'm gonna be making nachos nachos are traditionally made out of tortilla chips but today we're gonna substitute that because we don't have it we're gonna use doritos and um basically for nachos you just need cheese cheese is the most important thing uh your chips cheese and I mean, obviously, everybody has like different dietary, so you can make your nachos however you want them. I mean, let's break away from tradition a bit. Sometimes it's okay to just respect your taste, but allow me to take you through the ingredients you're gonna need and a step by step process. So let's get to it. Um, so we have three packets of burritos. Um, you can choose any flavor you want and nachos usually are spicy so I mean like I said to your own preference and then this is the main guy the cheese that's gonna go over the chips this whole recipe doesn't really need um, an oven a microwave I mean even if you don't have both of those things you can still make it because you can make your cheese sauce and then you just spread it over and then you put your toppings so it's not necessary that you have an oven or a microwave so moving on for our toppings we're gonna make um salsa i already prepared everything uh, we're gonna make salsa so our salsa is gonna consist of uh, the tomato, the cucumber, the onion, and the parsley. Um, I usually put coriander, but I didn't have it this time. So, I mean, like, you know, you use any herb that you like, honestly. Yeah. So, our guacamole also is gonna consist of the main guy the avocados, onion our lemon juice usually you would put a uh, lime juice but i mean it's the same thing and then i don't have cilantro but i mean we're just gonna make it work i also don't have cumin we'll just see um how it goes and then my mince here is a bit nice spicy yeah because none of these ingredients are gonna be um, very spicy so I just decided to make the mince really spicy because I don't even have all the ingredients for the guacamole to be that spicy you know okay so your toppings you don't really need to have everything I have here you can just obviously like just literally hoi in everything you like uh, but the main important thing it's the cheese or the cheese sauce um, the mince, you can substitute it with shredded chicken or what else can you have? I don't know, for vegetarians, maybe mushrooms, you know, like just make them nice, you know, how you, any kind of beans, you know, black beans or like whatever you just want to put in there, you can put and salsa, I mean, everybody just does the salsa they are comfortable with whether it's a mango salsa, pineapple, whatever, you know. But the aim is to just respect your butt, taste buds. Yeah, great. So, um, let's get to it. Firstly, we're gonna put this in here. So you can do this on a flat pan if you're gonna put it in the oven. So after that, oh, so I preheated the oven and put it on 180 so that the cheese can melt. So next thing is we're just going to take this and just hold it over here. Yeah. Way me and you since you mixed up with a bad crew on Facebook. I don't know who sent request to who, but ooh, that's what I said when I first saw you. This is done, guys, and I'm gonna put it in the oven until the cheese melts. Uh, yeah, and everything is fine and fire. So, yeah, like I told you, even if you don't have an oven, you can still make this. 
so yeah okay, so now we're gonna be making the salsa like I said before uh, for the salsa I'm gonna be using my tomato my cucumber and my parsley and onion and we're gonna be and then we're gonna be taking <laughs> we're gonna be using the lemon juice yes um, so let's get to it So I just needed to change the dish because that one was just small. Um, so this is what it looks like. Um, so I'm gonna cut this in half because another half I'm gonna save it for the guacamole. Yeah, and then I'm gonna put the parsley in and then maybe a bit of salt to taste. I don't have black pepper, we ran out, so that's fine. I also don't have the juicer guys so you forgive me I'm just gonna need a dish cloth Yes, so our salsa is done. Yes, this is it. Um, maybe let me just put nyana salt in to taste nyana, wabona. To taste nyana. That's it. thing is to cut your avocados in half uh, for the guacamole and obviously deep heat I'm gonna take these out I'm gonna scoop them out and I'm go not gonna have all the ingredients uh, for the traditional guacamole but I think what I have can do um, yeah so I just have the onion, I don't have the cilantro, I don't have cumin, I have salt though, and I have the tomato, I also have parsley which I'm gonna put in, so hopefully it's gonna be a nice one. Um, so I'm just gonna squash it so that in there very nice and soft. Ooh, can I take a mud like a whole can? Hey, I can look. No matter what life may bring, I'm committed, I'm gonna stay by your side. That's for real. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hoi in my nicely chopped onion i'm not gonna put all of it i mean i don't think everybody just likes the onion also the tomato so um i'm just thinking that i could also make a sauce 
for dipping but i think the guacamole would be sharp for that you can just dip your chips in the guacamole and life goes on I just put in the parsley and there's onion and tomato in here I'm all, I'm still gonna put the the juice Um, so this is how it looks like when it's done so just a little bit to zoom on this this is what you want yeah um if it was still hot it was still gonna if it was still hot yes this is what you want this is what you want this this is it guys Woo! yes i've made it in life so you could just have this. I'm gonna demonstrate the app. Heaven. No, just have it. <laughs> so this you can just literally just have this and just dip it and that's it. You don't need all of this. You can just dip it and just this is it. I didn't take a lot, but yeah. Guys, group is just like you know this videographer is not okay. But anyway, so for our toppings, we're gonna put our mince. Since you mixed up with a bad crew on Facebook, I don't know who sent requests to who, but ooh, that's what I said when I first saw you. I <laughs> never told you. This is it, guys. Uh, I'm just gonna save that for later. So, this is how it looks like, and then you're just gonna dip in your guacamole. You're just going to dip in your guacamole. This will be done if it never is tearing us up. We'll love to hide because we know you know it's better than us. So this is a big reveal time, you know that moment where you taste, yeah, Lampot. Okay, so get on taste that. How can I do? Wait, let me take this one. Ooh, this is perfect. You can have this at your parties as starters, you know. You know how it's really hard to just like try and figure out what's what at parties what can you make also everybody at res you know i mean like i say you don't need a stove no you need a stove <laughs> you don't need an oven or a microwave just like make your cheese sauce and then you spread it over and then you just put every ingredient that you want so even people at red you can just have it as a snack after class or when you're chilling with your friends on a friday watching movies or doing whatever yes even about baba last man you can just you know this is the best meal <laughs> This is heaven. I hope you try this at home and whatever you use, just tag me. Thank you. And I'm gonna go ahead and eat. Oh.